speaking test number three. Okay. Yes. So uh, bef before we begin, uh, so can you tell me what's your name and how old you are, please? Um, my name is Lingman Twelve years old. Twelve years old. Yes. Okay, very good. So in the test, I will ask you some questions about three books that you have learned before. Okay. So let's begin. Let's start with five others. Okay. Do you think that firefighters important community workers? Yes. Why? Because uh, they keep us safe. Keep us safe? Yes. What do they do to keep us safe? Um, they put out fires. Put out fires. And what do they need to put out fires? They need a hose. Need a hose? Yes. What else? Uh, access. Access? Water. Water. And um, air tanks. Air tanks. And smoke uh, masks. Smoke masks. What else? Letters. <laughs> Very good. Okay, many, many tools, right? Um, do you know what, what kind of tools um, do they need to spray water on the fire? Um, uh, tanker trucks. Tanker trucks, and they need a hose also, right? And what tools do they need to reach high places? They use letters. Letters to reach high places. And how about the ones that they need to? Break down doors, windows. They use access. Access, break down doors. Right. Okay, very good. Um, so, can you name two different kinds of fires that we usually see? Um, forest fires and fire with leaves. Very good, forest fires. So, do you think that in forest fires, can the firefighters use the Do you think that is there a road inside the forest? The streets, a road? Yes. Yes? Is it big or small? The road? So you can ride inside the forest. But there are many, many trees, right? Yes. In the forest. So, you know, sometimes the uh, uh, fire trucks cannot get into the forest. Right? Yes. So, what kind of machine do they have to use? To put out forest fires. They use airplanes. Airplanes. Yeah. So airplanes will dump the chemicals yes. and, and water on forest fire. Very good. <laughs> so um, can you name tools that firefighters use uh, uh, to to breathe safely? Air tank and smoke mask. Okay. Uh, how about the kind of trucks that the firefighters use to uh, carry ladders? Uh, they use ladder trucks. And how about the one that carries water? Tank And how about the one that is full of firefighters? Fire trucks. Very good. So let's talk about community workers. Okay. Yes. Um, first, can you tell me the name of the two community workers who keep people safe? What do they use to, you know, in their job? Thermometer. So why do they have to use the thermometer? So maybe to, to measure the temperature. Yeah. See so about maybe if you're very sick, okay, if you're very hot, okay, they will measure you know, uh, your uh, temperature, body temperature, uh, forty degrees or thirty nine. Um, so let's talk about uh, police officers. Okay. So do you think that police officers are important people in our community? Yes. Why? Because uh, they are yeah, they keep us safe. Yes. Uh, what do they do to help people keep us safe? They fix problems, uh, help lost students. How about, do, do, do you see the police officers on the streets? Yes. What do they do on the streets? Um, 
How about the one who you know drive very fast? Boom, boom, boom. So they stop the speeders, speeders, and they also they direct the traffic, right? Okay. Um, all right. So can you tell me um, what tools do police officers use in their job? Okay. But what is it used for? To catch people, right? Not to kill people. <laughs> Maybe to shoot at the legs so they cannot run. Okay. Um, so tell me, how do the police officers in Vietnam travel? Cars. Cars. Bike. Bikes. Walk. They might walk, right? Some might be used, you know, helicopters. Yeah. But not, you know, many helicopters in Vietnam. Okay, and so uh, how about the uniform? Can you describe the uniform of the police officers? Uh, so they are, their uniforms can be green. Green, yes, yes. usually green. And uh, how about the police officers in the streets, like the cop? They are white. White? No, tan. Yes, okay. So. Uh, do you want to be a police officer or the firefighter when you grow up? You want to be a police officer? Do you think you you know you're strong enough no. to become a police officer? No. What do you need to do in order to become a police officer? To study. Study? Just to study? Sit in the room with people to study and that's it? Maybe go to the police school. Yes, and to train the body a lot because you need to be very strong. Yes, and you need to run very fast to catch bad people. Yes. Right? Okay, thank you. Thank you, uh, you know, uh, so I think you did a very good job. Okay, bye bye. Say goodbye. Goodbye.